Hello everyone, Gabriel John Coombs here once again, getting back to Let's Play Mega Man The Wily Wars for the Sega Genesis. In the last video, we made our way through Needle Man stage once again and got rid of Doc Air and Doc Crash. This time, we're going, and the ever annoying Doc Crash. This time we're going to go through Gemini Man stage once again, where Doc Flash and Doc Bubble await us. So, yeah, with that, let's get to it. Alrighty, so yeah, coming into this stage, bugs, yay, and hey, the ever so annoying enemies of this stage has a, a style change, look at that. Now, um, you want to take this stage carefully, or at least this room, because uh, for any perfect runners out there, the perfect run... A, a Mega Man game you need to have your buster only and no damage there's a lot of enemies that could possibly catch you off guard so you really want to take this room carefully if you're going on perfect runs I prefer to full stage carefully but you can, don't have to it's only the room you have to watch out for and there we go so far so good Ow, 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 ow. Too much fire everywhere. Okay, so this time there's no Proto Man, and the door is already open for us. And I completely missed the question mark block. Surprise, surprise. And as per the usual, and. Just like I said in the normal Gemini Man stage, be careful here because there are spikes as you may have seen there a minute ago. There we go, there's the spikes. You want to take this very, very carefully going through. Because if you land in spikes and you never reach checkpoint, you gotta do that first room all over again. I'm gonna take out this top one just to be safe as well, I think. I'm not going to bother with the question mark box up there. Because sometimes it agrees with me and becomes like a free man or something. But most times it's just like extra weapon energy or something like that. Like a small weapon energy. So, how unlucky of me. <laughs> so, anyway. We need to make kind of a stepping area here. There we go. Might as well take the high road here. Just in case, because I can't remember exactly if there's spikes in that small area. And I see a free man, I'll take that. And hey, we're already at the first boss. You are going to need the needle cannon for this. Because that is Doc Flash's weakness. All right. So, so good. Stupid Flash Man. Stupid Doc Flash having a ridiculously large hitbox. Anyway, there you go. And uh, wow, he didn't use the Flash Stopper, the Flash Bomb, or whatever for that entire battle. That was actually very well done. Anyway. We need the assistance of Rush Coil for this. And we can move on. The holes in the ceilings there will let you know that um, there's bugs coming out of them. And yeah, this is going to be a little hard. Getting through this area is not going to be too terribly bad, but we got to get through this area with uh, the missile launchers and everything. Rush Jet is the best option here, but you can also use uh, Rush Marine if you want. <laughs> Trust me, I've used Rush Marine in practice and I end up dying for it. 
But anyway, slide through. And you might want to slide. Like that. And up the ladder we go. Now the, these next couple rooms are filled with bugs. The holes in the ceiling. Just watch where they come out and you should be fine. Climb up the ladder. Don't waste your time killing the bugs if you don't have to. If you have to kill them, then kill them. If not, then leave them alone. Anyway, back in the water again, and there's a boss door. That means Doc Bubble awaits us. And Doc Bubble's weakness is the Spark Shock. Enter Doc Bubble. And if you just keep peppering him with spark shocks, he's not going to do much on attacks, or at least do much damage to you. He may still hit you once or twice, but overall he's pretty simple. And there you go, he's already dead. Yay, us. Alright, so let's save it. Alright, four down, four to go. Um, in the next video, we will go back to Shadow Man stage. Where uh, it's time to heat things up a little bit. Yeah, Doc Heat's in there in that stage, in Shadow Man stage, but he's also with Doc Wood. Doc Wood and Doc Heat. Kind of an odd combination considering uh, Woodman's weakness is Heat Man's weapon. But anyway, until next time, this is Gabriel John Coombs saying adios amigos.